Hi, my name is Ilya and I am Sion, co-founder of Bitscout. And in this short video, I wanted to show you how we have created a trip expense uh, reporting system using Make and uh, Monday. So here is the form which you can fill in as a trip report. And you can upload the expenses here. Um, that can be PDF files or photos. Let's do that. Trip to... Uh, you can put a timeline. Let's say it happened between 2nd to 8th of May. And then my name is Ilya. So now I'm going to add a couple of uh, exam, couple of invoices here. So I've added two, two files, um, expenses. And uh, what will happen is now the task will appear in, the, in this scenario. And... Uh, uh, we'll trigger the make um, scenario to extract information, understand what's the, uh, what is the expenses we're looking at. Is it a flight, a hotel, or a rental car? And uh, type receive this information in the in Monday. So as you can see, it's running. So let's see how it goes. Okay. So as you can see here, we're getting data about the items. Okay, it will take some time and now it will update to have more information about what it is because typically what you get is you try to read the expense yourself and then you know put the, this information into the uh, fields of your tool but in this case it's done automatically uh, make is handling the extracting of the data uh, make is handling the um, understanding how many files we have and uh, what BitScout does is, uh, first of all, it extracts the data from the invoice. Okay. So here is uh, lots of information about what it is. And then it understands what is the type of um, expense. Is it a hotel or something? In this case, it detected correctly. Uh, so we have a rental car from Europe car and Astoria as a hotel. Okay. So this is a, a simple example done in less than 10 minutes uh, of how you can build a trip expense report. And then uh, the status can be moved to approved and it will move to approved uh, area and uh, you know go to uh, another system or DocuGen will generate a trip report. Okay, I hope it Thanks a lot for your attention and uh, ping me anytime.